it's hard to believe the whirlwind of emotions surrounding the royal family lately, isn't it? As we all know, King Charles's health has been a hot topic, and it's forced everyone yes, even the servants to think about what the future holds for the monarchy. Have you ever wondered what happens behind those grand palace walls during such intense moments? Tell us in the comments below. With this health crisis hanging over them, Charles has made it clear that he wants Prince William and Princess Catherine to take the reins, particularly when it comes to raising their children. This shift in responsibility has stirred quite the conversation among royal watchers. It's fascinating to see how the family dynamics evolve, especially considering that King Charles has been more decisive regarding his three grandchildren. What do you think about the idea of the younger royals stepping into more prominent roles? Interestingly, tensions have spiked within the family, especially after some comments from Queen Camilla about Prince Louis. Reports suggest she likened his behavior to that of Prince Harry, raising eyebrows and concerns. Now, isn't that quite the accusation? King Charles, who sees Louis as a cheerful little chap, was reportedly taken aback by Camilla's remarks. How do you feel about family members discussing each other like that? Tell us in the comments. As we dig deeper into these family dynamics, it's clear that King Charles cherishes his grandkids, especially Louis. In fact, there are whispers about him establishing a financial fund for Louis's future. It's such a lovely thought, isn't it? And as he matures, there are speculations about the titles he might inherit, like Prince Edward or even Prince Andrew. Which title do you think would suit him best? Looking back, Charles has expressed some regrets about his parenting, especially concerning Harry. It seems he's reflecting on how he supported his children during their formative years, particularly through his turbulent divorce from Princess Diana. Wouldn't it be interesting to know how the family feels about these past decisions? Tell us what you think. Camilla's role within the family hasn't been easy either. Over the years, she's faced quite a bit of public scrutiny and has often felt like an outsider. With the late Queen Elizabeth's expectations looming over her, it must be tough to navigate. What's your take on how the media has treated her? Is it fair or unfair? Share your thoughts in the comments. The shift in power dynamics is becoming evident. Recently, William and Catherine released an Instagram video about Catherine's recovery from cancer without King Charles's approval. This signifies a growing independence and authority for the couple, doesn't it? What do you think this means for the future of the royal family? Prince William is also gearing up for a more global role by appointing a new private secretary, but his plans were briefly derailed by Catherine's health crisis. It's incredible to see how these events intertwine, isn't it? And while Harry seems content with his distance from the family, he reportedly wishes to mend things with his father. Do you think there's hope for reconciliation, or has that ship sailed? Tell us in the comments. As King Charles continues his health journey, the royal family faces internal challenges over the future reign. It's a captivating time for the monarchy, and we can only wonder what's next. Don't forget to share your thoughts and theories in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this discussion, be sure to like and subscribe for more royal news updates.